This lesson is on how to change fractions to decimals by using short division and that's just one way of doing it. There are a few ways. Main thing you've got to remember when you are either using a calculator or using short division is to read this as a division sum and it's always the top number divided by the bottom number. So if you were to use your calculator to change one quarter into a decimal you would just go 1 divided by 4 equals. So it's always top number divided by bottom number. So that's the quick way by using a calculator. But if you don't have a calculator, a good way of doing these is by using short division. It doesn't matter what fraction you've got, you can do it if you know how to do short division. So when you set up the short division, it's always the bottom number goes on the outside and the other number, the top number, goes on the inside like that. And you read this 1 divided by 4, you read this 1 divided by 4, or how many 4s in 1. And because you're changing it into a decimal, you need to have a decimal point here and here. And how many 4s are there in 1? There are none, so you put a 0 here, and as many zeros down here as you need. And because you haven't used that one, you carry it to to in front of the next number so then that looks like a 10 and you go how many fours in 10 the answer is 2 and there's 2 left over and then how many fours in 20 there's 5 so 1 quarter is equal to 0 0.25 so that's the decimal for 1 quarter okay example 2 now you can also do it when the top number is bigger than the bottom number like this. It's still the top number divided by the bottom number. So again, setting up a short division, bottom number on the outside, other number on the inside, or the top number on the inside, put a point here, and as many zeros as you might need, and then make sure you put a point above this point, and then how many twos in seven? There's three, there's one left over, so put that in front of the zero, how many twos in 10? There's 5 and there's none left over. So that's what 7 over 2 is equal to. It's equal to 3.5. And another way of reading this is 7 halves. Example 3, 1 over 8 or 1 eighth. Change that to a decimal. Again, setting up the short division. Bottom number on the outside and the top number on the inside. Put a point and for this one you'll need a couple of zeros. And then a point there, how many 8s in 1? There are none, because you haven't used that one, you carry it here. How many 8s in 10? There's 1, and then there's 2 left over. How many 8s in 20? There's 2. 2 8s are 16, so that means there's going to be 4 left over. Put another 0 there, and then how many 8s in 40? There's 5, so 1 8, and then there's none left over. And so 1 eighth is equal to 0 0.125. So these are the types of questions that are on the exercise. So because it's about using short division, make sure you do the short division and then you can always check your answer with the calculator and there are answers at the bottom of the exercise as well. So that's it for this lesson and I'll see you in the next one.